And more now on the story about the late Te Awanuiarangi Black, who's been outed by his widow as a pedophile. A tauranga iwi nai te rangi says it will pay an $11,000 cash reward for anyone with information about the claims who comes forward. It's been four days now since Anihira Black posted a Facebook video in which she claimed Mr Black was part of a child sex ring in Tauranga. She made a passionate plea for his victims to speak out, but police say no one has come forward to them. This story by Te Aniwa Hurihanganui starts with a part of Anihira Black's video. We give you permission to speak your truth. Take back the power of the secret. It has no power in the light. Give yourself permission to be heard. Be it a whisper or a blood curdling scream, just be heard. Despite Anihira Black's plea to potential victims of her late ex-husband, no victim has yet been identified to police. But Tauranga Iwi Ngai Terangi is taking matters into its own hands. Its chief executive, Paura Stanley, says they're offering cash for anyone to come forward with information. So I asked my chair to see whether we could put up a sum of money for anybody who could bring information to the table. When he asked me how much, I said, well, 10K, and I'll pull out 1,000 bucks out of my own pocket and throw it in and make it leave him. The iwi chair, Charlie Tafiao, says they are deeply concerned by the allegations and claims of a child sex ring in Tauranga. He says they'll do what it takes to find out if it's true. We don't know whether it will help, but what we want to do is do everything we can to encourage people with information to come forward as soon as possible. Mr Stanley says he worked in the prisons for six years and during that time he exposed two paedophiles to authorities after seeing them work at schools. He says a lot is at stake. It's a desperate attempt, but we've got to, we've got to do something because there's no information coming about. We've got to find out you know, the veracity of this allegation. And I have my, my children, my mukos, all live in this city. I want to know that they're going to be safe. Anihira Black would not be interviewed by RNZ, but it is understood that she is pleased with the reward for information. The police say the $11,000 offer is a matter for the iwi. In a statement released this afternoon, police say no victims have come forward or been identified. Tauranga's Deputy Mayor Calvin Clout says the allegations have shocked the community, but the council hasn't formally spoken about it. Obviously the community needs to be concerned and I'm sure this is not a Tauranga only or Bay of Plenty only issue, the issue of sexual abuse and people sort of being undercover and going underground is obviously a nationwide issue. The Facebook video has been viewed close to 390,000 times now. Ngai Te Rangi is hoping others will contribute money to grow the reward to get to the bottom of allegations that are still sending waves through the Bay of Plenty. For Checkpoint, I'm Tianiwa Hurihanganui.